Hello and welcome back again to my YouTube channel. I would like to share with you today a couple kinds of kebbis. One of them is the classic fried kebbi and the other one is rolled and boiled kebbi. So let's get started. For the dough and the stuffing of the kebbis, I'm gonna leave the um, link of the two recipes in the description box. So please go and check the description box for the dough and the stuffing. So let's get started for shaping the kibbits. I shaped three different types of kibbits. These are the small ones. This is a bite size. It's very good size for appetizer and parties. And this is the medium, the classic size of the kibbit. Uh, again, those are fine kibbits. And these are the large uh, rolled boiling cabbage these are only to boil for so I portioned the dough size of walnuts and as you see I'm trying to make a cavity just make a hole gently and roll the dough with the help of little water and this takes practicing but it is very easy as you see it just make it as thin as possible and then fill the cavity with the um, stuffing and bring all the sides of the dough together and I intentionally made this part of the video on slow motion so you can see it Again, this is all about practicing and I'm sure you can do it. And here I shaped the large boiling kebbis. Just take the portion larger. And instead of shaping it narrow, the two sides, just roll it. Roll it like a ball. And then boil it in salted water for about five to eight minutes. So you got the point, the more you practice, the more you master it. It's all about practicing, as we all know, but just try it. It is delicious, it's worth it, the whole effort. And then I added canola oil in a deep frying pan and I fried the kibbiz for a couple minutes each side until they are lightly golden brown and in the picture it is a little darker because of the lights and then I boiled the rolled ones in salted water for eight minutes and this is the finished product I hope you enjoy watching this making the kibbiz you should try it. Please don't forget to subscribe and share. Thank you for watching.